It's time to open up the bee box here. Oh. Open sesame. Now, as you can see, we've got a couple over here. That's fine. That's why you have this little hole, because otherwise they would have gummed the whole thing up with propolis. What's propolis? Propolis is the sticky stuff made out of pollen and nectar. Why is it so oh, I cool. go around with my little hive tool here, smoke? lever this up. Ah, I'm cool without the smoke. Come on, Dad. Now nah, we'll be fine. No, take your brush. Okay. Just gonna gently pry this off here. A lot of bees. There's a lot of bees, guys. Time to take off the actual lid here. here. Trying to be very oh, careful not to squish any bees. Careful. So, is it is the top yellow? Oh, oh wow. Oh. Mm, that looks so good. So I'm guessing I'm guessing those oh, are larvae. Eggs in it. Yeah, I'm oh, guessing those are larvae. Those are larvae. So is it is the wow. top? Wow, they are building honeycomb right up to the top. Well, Which is yeah. funny because they're really that's really great. Oh. Here I'll go a I'll go closer. A brass Whoa. Look yeah. at that. There's honey dripping out of it. Uh so the funny thing is I'm seeing some frames at the edges that aren't even used. And meanwhile, they're putting babies on the lid. That's sad. That's kind of silly of them. So that's let's take out one of these guys. Oh. So I am going to Put this empty frame between some of the full frames, and that is going to hopefully encourage them to start building up more wax in the actual frames instead of up here on the uh, on the uh, on the roof. Okay, so going to slide that empty frame in there very gently. Very you don't want carefully. to squish any bees. <laughs> don't want to squish any of these little friends of mine here. Now another thing we want to do, because there's a lot of larvae up here, we want to make sure that the queen is not up on the roof. So can you see the queen? Mm -hmm. Yep, the queen is a lot bigger. Yeah, so like we haven't seen it right now. Uh, She's probably inside, isn't she? You see any bee that's just a lot bigger than the rest? Yep. No. No, just chill. Remember, no, I chill. think she might be inside the box, though. So. Okay, I'm thinking she's still in the box. She'll be near the mo the youngest babies. So the babies up here... They look fairly old. ...are nice and old. Yeah. So, so hopefully these larvae that are up on the roof aren't going to die. I'd feel really bad if I killed a bunch of my babies. <laughs> yeah. So Whoa. again... Oh, check that out, though. Yeah, I know. It's so much, so many bees, right? So much life. Understandably, these little guys are going to be freaking out right now. Because literally their world is just going crazy. So their whole hive has collapsed. This, one, this way. So I don't really understand what's the point of shifting the wood things. So, because they're putting... Uh, bees typically will go to the frame next to them and if there is an empty frame between two full frames yeah then they'll be like oh obviously we should put some honey and stuff there yeah so that's what we want oh so you're kind of moving the empty frames in the middle so that they'll choose those ones instead that is literally it yeah, oh yeah that frame is full queen? now oh. these two frames are propolis together yeah it. it's like they're glue there's also like a, a little dead, well, a little, dead bees. no, honeycomb that's just not being used right now, oh, yeah. or whatever you would call it. Oh yeah, that's cool. Lots of babies in there. So now I'm going to take this guy and slide oh, it. Oh, you smushed one. Look at that one. Stop saying you smushed one. No, look. He's getting back up. Very look, gently. Look they don't seem to mind to walk over each other. So. <laughs> no, walking over each other is something they seem okay with. Yeah. Now you'll notice there's a lot of bees crowding on these little larvae. Are they eating them because they're dying anyway, because they're out of their shell? Or are they uh, trying to save them? I have no idea. That's some gorgeous honeycomb right there, though. Yeah, I, I know. It looks really good. Um, well, are they, like, feeding them? No, they're not feeding the larvae, are they? I don't think so. Because they, don't, they don't, might not be eating them, so... 
I mean, yeah, they might just be trying to feed them and make sure they're okay. Yeah. Um, either way, I guess it's time to put the lid back on. We're not gonna add a new box yet, as I was saying, because we still have one, two, three, four, about five frames that have room, so we're not gonna, we're not gonna do that yet. Um... The, the little door, there's still one with another door. Is that okay? Huh? Is it okay to have, like, there's one little door and the other big one? So bees get stressed out if they have too much material to guard, but like this, if they have those two little doors, that should be cool. And then actually in, a, in another week or two, I'm going to take that out completely so that there, it's just a nice big opening. Oh. And that way they'll, they'll have lots of air and they won't get too hot in the summer. So we're going to put the, uh, the lid, the, well it's not the lid, it's sort of the top. We're going to put that back on. All oh, those poor little baby larvae. I feel terrible. I might have killed them. <laughs> But well, not all of too them. too late now. Oh, well, yeah, I mean, there's... So this is the overflow of what's in there. There's hundreds of those yeah. in there. Oh, oh yeah. To pick it up there's hundreds of them. So, I mean, like, the hundreds of others that are inside are going to be okay. So... Yeah. It's fine. I do feel bad. All right. Uh, now it's time for the brush. Yay! Yay! So Finally. I don't want any bees dying because they're hanging out on the edge. Just I just want to gently... poke in that honey so Oof. that I can taste something. You know what? Yeah, you could poke in that honey and taste some, and it would be delicious. <laughs> hey, my brush. Should I? I'm just gonna like, like, doink, doink. Go ahead. Yeah. Sure. You know really? what? Okay. Can I'm gonna be very gentle, and I'm just like. It might be angry because you're doing their work. Mmm, it's really good. Yeah, it tastes like honey. Like. <laughs> it, it is honey. It's, yeah, I know. <laughs> it's it's less thick than the than the usual one. Daniel, come here and taste it. And it's like more liquid. It's really good. So just very carefully dip one little finger in there. Nice and slow. And Marlon, how is it? Soft. Tasting? Yeah? It's much less sugar sugary. But really? it, it showed the, the texture. I think it tastes very sugary. Maybe I didn't taste enough. Really. I don't know. Oh, it's time to close this back up. I'm just going to brush these guys off. Oh, Check this out because it's going to freak them wait, out. Wait, I just want to, like... Off you go. Off you go. There. That's Get better. out of here. Get out of here. All right. Now, we're going to very okay. gently, we're going to put one side down. And so, slowly, slowly ease this back down. They're all kind of clumping in the one spot here. Is there like anything, are they making anything over here? Like a more honeycomb? Well, see, there's a oh, door look, there. Oh, look, the queen. That might be the queen. Yeah, here. What is she doing up there? Okay. She looks like she's dying. She needs to go back down. Back she's like, no, down. no, he's lifting her. Now, typically the queen would not be by herself, so I wonder if that's actually the queen. Let me see if I can get her to climb onto this brush so that I can oh. gently get her back to that hole. I, I wonder if she's the if that's the queen or just the drone. Yeah, what oh, is the drone? She is definitely bigger. Drones are useless men that have sex with the queen to make babies. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've heard of those before. Come on. So are all these bees female then? Or No, they're all I but think there's just some there's just certain males that are drones then. Yeah. Come on, in you go. Okay, the queen is getting back no, in that, the hive. Well if it is because it's... I see three drones right there. Oh really? Are they all that big? Yeah. Okay. Then yeah. Good, this yeah. Is the not... queen would usually be in the heart of the hive laying eggs. Yeah, have this isn't so that yeah. Have I doubt that that's that's a, that is the queen. All right, time Look to put the lid back on, folks. Wait, what about there? Oh, yeah, so we're just going to brush this right here. Now, that's actually gonna, their other door. Okay. So... Oh, it's... that is... Oh, yeah. Well, there's a bee stuck on your door. Okay. This is cool. You guys can just stay off of that, please, so that nobody gets squished. And once again, we're going to very yeah. gently lay that down. I have a dead bee. Can I have a dead like, Sure, although the that's that a little weird. Dead, but like, not put that down really slow, so hopefully they don't now get there's spooked. there's bees all over you. There's one on your arm, like... Can I burst them off of you? No, yeah, that's cool. Can Come I on. turn it off? Oh, yeah, sure. Something I should have already done, and okay. didn't do because I was silly, and that is I'm putting on the queen excluder. 
So these holes are just big enough that the queen can't get through to make sure that the queen doesn't go up into the top part of the hive. So those larvae that we saw down there means that the queen was probably in that part of the hive. And that's, oh no, What? despite my best efforts, that bee oh, was no. definitely killed as I put the lid on. Can I have it? Oh yeah. Please. 